So this would have been um, the first people to build a home, the first people to raise animals, the first people to plant a garden on this land and stay here would have been the Métis settlers in the late 1800s. We are a culture that's alive and thriving. So behind me we have the white buffalo where we share the stories of our past and the buffalo hunt and the buffalo council. And just to the north of us we have our solar farm which I think is a big move forward for the Métis people. So it's great for us to be able to share the past and the future all at one time. I think for many, many years, our citizens, and even more so now I see our youth, are very concerned that we all have to be concerned about climate change and what do we do about it. So I think it's, it's, it's important that we do that. The Métis Nation of Alberta, we just started looking at what to do around climate change back in 2017. We talked to over 300 of our citizens and they resoundingly told us that as a Métis government of Métis people in Alberta, we need to do something about it and make a measurable impact on climate mitigation. And it, it's so exciting to have a 100% Métis-owned solar project. Well, I believe the Métis Nation should be very excited. This is um, a huge piece that the Métis Nation has been talking about for a long time. And it, it is the largest Métis Nation-owned solar project in Canada. So Métis people have coexisted with the land for hundreds of years. And uh, the, the, the shift in energy generation to a sustainable source is part of humanity coexisting with nature. And uh, that's where I see Métis knowledge and Indigenous knowledge coming into renewables is that we're creating a sustainable energy source that can coexist with the new way of, that we're moving in our economy. The solar farm consists of 12,840, 480 watt bifacial solar panels, 36 separate DC to AC inverters. So obviously there's the climate mitigation effect of this, which means that uh, we estimate that's going to be 4,700 tons of CO2 on the first year and you know and we'll get that over 25 years so there's that piece and uh, we're very honored that the Métis Nation has uh, employed a Métis contractor and its own people in putting them to work on such a great monumental project for our nation and it's almost like hanging out with my family again it's a little bit different like you can tell but we're all almost still the same family it's really cool actually um, it's just been really refreshing to work with partners that are just so willing and able to support us. You know, ADCO as our partners here, Carvel Electric as, as one of our Métis subcontractors there. Everywhere we look, we just found people just really believing in what we're trying to achieve and helping us out. So you're actually getting to see somebody's dream uh, turn into a reality. Uh, and then that reality goes to improving the, the community. The milestone towards reducing our carbon footprint, transitioning to net zero, acting upon that climate change plan that has been in the works for a long time.